What's up, man? Welcome to our home. Come in. You're here with My Darkest Days, and this is our home. So, you guys want to start talking about what we do in here? Well, uh, this we live. Is where we live. Uh, drive every single day to a different city to play a different show. and This is where we put shoes. Usually, but we really don't follow our own rules. But yeah, it's team. usually a lot more messy. It's Actually, over here is uh, our TV. This is where we play a lot of Xbox. Halo, and four Halo, player, Halo. Four player. Entertainment system with a Nintendo 64. With Goldeneye. Oh yeah, maybe. Of course. Kind of like a kitchen area, uh, but instead of most places where you would put cups, uh, we actually stuff all our clothes in here. Yeah. And usually something will probably fall out. Oh. Uh, got lucky today. Keep our clothes in all these cabinets. And uh, so if you ever come in here and you want someone to drink, there's probably dirty underwear in here. Not cups or plates. Fridge. And fridge, which we've attached baby straps to so they don't fall eye open on the road. Yeah, we got tons of this stuff, man. Monster, it's the key, dude. This is what keeps us alive throughout the day. Waking up. Our fridge is stocked with this stuff. Yeah. That and Corona. We got no Cristal, we got lots of beer. Lots and lots of beer. And Jaeger too, actually. Lots of Jaeger. We don't have much food though in our fridge. It's pretty much all alcohol. Oh, and alcohol monster. usually. Lots of booze. We just spend most of our time right here. That's Joe's little office over here. Yeah, our tour That's manager's our, office is right he sits here. Sits and does his thing. This is my cupboard. Everything's as you can see neatly folded. Reed uh, <laughs> just just wears monster clothes. That's right. <laughs> and uh, a lot of bad things have happened on these couches that we should probably not talk about. Actually, don't even touch the couch. Yeah, like the bunks are really small, so it's hard to do really bad things in your bunks, whereas this you have a lot of space. Um, so just don't put a black light on anything around here. <laughs> that won't be good. Be like, so you guys want to switch to night vision and, and see what's going on back here? This is called Bunk Alley. This is actually where all of our bunks are, where all of us live. Um, right here is Dougie's bunk. On top of here is our driver's bunk. Um, Murphy. Down here is my bunk. This would be Brendan's bunk. Um, this is Joe, our tour manager's bunk, a.k.a. the koala bear. Um, up here is our guitar tech bunks, James. Um, right here we got Reed, his bunk, and this is Matt's bunk. And he's actually using it right now, too. <laughs> Again, don't put a black light on anything around here. You might find stuff that uh, could be possibly incriminating. Back here we got our bathroom. Um, yeah, it's pretty nasty. You probably don't want to go inside here. And at the very back over here, we got um, pretty much a shower room, um, sink, yeah, where we shower and hang out, get ready before the shows. And this is pretty much, uh, you know, the way we live. Doug, do you want to show them what the bunks look like here? Kind of ex explain what's going on. Uh, I kind of have my little studio kind of set up over in the corner here. I got the condo bunk because I'm the toughest guy in the bunch. <laughs> but uh, anyways, yeah, I got a little studio set up over here. I like to write a lot of songs and just spend a lot of time in here watching movies and writing tunes and stuff. No one else wanted that bunk. <laughs> no one else gets it. There's a separation between the driver's cab and the actual, where the band stays. So you can actually climb through the window as um, you're moving for the smokers. They can jump in here and have their own smoking area in there, which is actually pretty cool. The coolest thing about this bus is probably all the stories that go along with it and everything that's happened on here and all the fun stuff that we get to do all the time on it. Um, aside from that, it's better than driving around America with your best friends. Yeah. 